Hey, cute people. Let's give it up for the girls who do not have to spend more than one hour to get their lighting decent to make a video. Oh, my goodness. This is one of the reasons why you don't see me so often is because it takes such a long time to get the lighting right. So I think I've done an okay job. It's not going to be the best, but it definitely isn't the worst. But you guys know that with me, I just feel like once I can get it to be the best that I can, and trust me, I try, I'm just going to keep going with it. That's what I'm going to do. So today I want to do a haul for you guys because I enjoy watching hauls and I enjoy making them and I enjoy shopping for the things that I'm going to show you. I believe hauls are for showing some of the things, not because look, ooh, look what I bought. That's not what I think it's for. I think it's just to share with you some opportunities and some things that you guys may be looking for and voila, somebody else gets them and you can go and pick them up from wherever. At least that's what I look for hauls for because I've come across a lot of great things watching people's hauls and then going to pick them up or just realize, oh wow, I didn't know they had that. Okay, so Look at this as that type of opportunity. And also, let me just ask you, tell you, I should say, because I'm good at telling people what to do. Not that you have to listen, but you should. Just subscribe to my channel. Yes. And like this video. Share with somebody else that you know that likes to shop, because I know I'm not the only one, nor are you. But like I mentioned, just, um, just subscribe to my channel and come back. I, I'm so sorry I don't do it as often as I like, because if I could, I would do it almost every day. And that's... um record and upload a video but um the lighting oh my gosh it takes me forever to get it right and then i get frustrated and then i'm i'm done but here we go so like i mentioned almost two minutes ago that um i picked up some stuff so i just want to share with you guys and i'm going to share it with you pretty much in some type of order what kind i don't know but we're going to start with um target yeah i'll start with target I meant to say Walmart, but we'll start with Target. Okay, now, Target is a store that I've only been to in my life five times. Maybe two times in New York. And then three, mm -hmm, three times since I've been here in North Carolina. And I like Target. I love shopping in Target. They have some very nice things. But to me, a lot of things there are overpriced as far as clothing, I'd say. And um, this cosmetic bag I bought, but I got it anyway because I want but um, let me show you some of the things that I got from Target. Okay, so the first thing that I've done since I've been going to Target, <laughs> since I've been here, I always check the jewelry out and I go straight to their clearance where they have so many pretty earrings. Like this pair right here, I got for $3.98. This pair I also got for $3.98. This pair. I also got for $3.98. And she also gave me something off. I can't remember what. And it was only because this here was not even. I mean, I can cut that. But I asked her and she said, sure. She gave me a dollar off of that one. Now, this one here is what started me asking about the discount on that earring. Is this one here. I thought it was so pretty. And um, it's broken. Let's see. But she gave me something off. Now, all these earrings, as you can see. On, were on clearance because I'm cheap and I hate to pay full price for anything. And I also picked up some um, Sally Hansen vitamin E cuticle oil, which was $5.99, but I wanted to try it. So when I finish with this, I'm going to take this clear label off and just put some oil in it and just continue to use it. Um, and I brought it only because I want to continue to um, take care of my nails, which I've always done. But, um, just go a step further with the cuticle oil and maybe cutting my um, cuticles and so forth and on. Also, at the store, I couldn't help myself. I always stop over to the um, elf section in any store I go into. And this here is the um, illuminating missing set. Okay. I love the um, original and I wanted to replace it, but then I saw this one. So I said, why not? I'll go ahead and get it. And if you can't tell, I have got to sneeze so bad. I try to hold then i got this here yes maybelline has some of the best drug, drugstore met, um let me say about this one makeup ever and this one here is the master contour kit this is number 20 it was on clearance it wasn't that cheap it was like maybe a dollar less than their regular price but i went on and got it anyway because i wanted to try it i don't know if this is the darkest one but i think um 
the highlight and yeah, I think the highlight will do me some good. Also, while I was at Target, I picked this up here. Like I mentioned to you, I'm always going to stop at the L section, so I got this brush here. This is their Selfie Ready Foundation Blurring Brush, which I thought brush, which I thought was three dollars, but when I got it home, it was six thousand. I almost had a fit, but I decided to keep it, so I got that. And I also picked up this goodie. Um, it's not a Tangle teaser. They call this a Tangle Fix. It's so small, I really can't see it, but it's supposed to remove tough. Um, Tangles. Now, if you remember when the Tangle teaser was so popular, I didn't want to get it only because I have tightly coiled hair, and um, I felt that these things here would rip my hair out. Now, I've tried this, and I've tried it maybe twice. I don't go all the way up my hair shaft. I just use it to um, help me detangle the uh, bottom part of my hair, and um, yeah, it rips my hair out. But it's a pretty, um, you see, it? it's pretty. So I think I'm going to keep it and just use it every now and then. Um, when my hair is not really dry, just to help me detangle the ends, and then I'll just do the rest with my fingers, because um, this way, it rip out my hair. And now, another thing that I picked up from Target, now remember I mentioned to you, I love Target, great store, beautiful stuff, overpriced as far as I'm concerned, everything as far as handbag that I see should be $10 cheaper. Now this bag here, I picked up, yes, I think it's gorgeous. You can see how it's made. Here. This bag here was $24.99. And I think, and still think, will always think this bag should be no more than $19.99. But I have a habit of seeing things, liking them, and then um, not buying it, going back after I decide, oh yeah, I want it, and then it's not there. So I said, I'm just going to go ahead and get it, even though I didn't want to pay the price for it. But I think it's so cute. Look, got card holder, little place here. You can stick other things here. It's definitely roomy because I have, um, I brought down here with me. Most of my stuff is still in New York in storage, but most of, yeah, most of my bags. But I bought two cross body bags in that I carry all the time, Nine West. And I love those bags, but, um, just carrying them all the time, you know, the wear and tear, and I didn't want to have them get destroyed so i said i'll buy another bag and i figured i'll look in target target is very fashion forward but very expensive as far as i'm concerned but i bought this bag and i think it's so in this leather it's just so pretty and chic and it's different so i got this now one thing that i did see in target that i wanted to purchase but again i did not want to pay and algae's acting up too so y'all excuse me i did not want to pay the price for it I saw this cosmetic bag and I didn't get it. And I thought about this bag when I got home and I said, I'm going to get this bag. I thought the price for it at first was $29.99, but it happened to be um, $19.99, which to me is still more than I like to pay for a cosmetic bag. But I love this design. Look at it so cute and the color on the inside. You see, it's deep. You can put a lot in here because right now I just stuck some beauty blenders in here that I hadn't used. I just put them inside. But I just think it's just so cute. I love the pattern, of course. And then you have here where you can stick some brushes. And also here, a netted um, compartment. Of course, you can stick other things in there. And I bought it really because I just had a lot of stuff here in my mother's house that was still staying here. Um, that I wanted to be able to put away, get out of the way. So I bought you that. Yeah, and it's just so cute. Look at it. I love it. Now, another thing that I picked up in Target, staying with cosmetics, is I told you guys I got a um, bootleg setup. Oh, I didn't tell you guys. So <laughs> you know I'm doing it on my cell phone. I got this here. Because remember, I mentioned to you I didn't have a Target that I would go to. That was close to me. And I know a lot of people always talk about Sonya Kashik. So I said, as soon as I get down south, I'm going to Target to check out Sonya Kashik. Well, I've been here for two years and hadn't checked her out. But just the other day, we decided to go and I got this. And I'm glad I did because it's a three-piece set. And this here was on clearance for $8.98. Something here is still 
But okay, so here's what it looks like on the inside. Just get some brushes in here, cover it up, which is great. You have the plastic. And as you can see, I haven't done much of anything with it. You have a little compartment here. The two bags, they do come off, but I just haven't taken them off. And let's see what else is here in this bag. And I just like it. I just thought it was really, really a great bag to have. To travel with and not only to travel just to store stuff with um here while i'm at my mom's house just to put stuff away and get it out of her way because i just have stuff which seems like it's just everywhere i mean everywhere but I, like i said i like target don't get me wrong i just think that um things should be cheaper they're so expensive but they do have some really gorgeous stuff in Target, right? And like I mentioned to you, I'm always in the habit of looking at something, not wanting to pay the full price for it, thinking I'm going to always get it on sale. And most times I do. But this here I had to get. Now, this here, it, it wraps around. All right? Okay, good. So you pull out your beach bag. It's hot and it's sunny. And then you, voila, it. put it on your head. I'm not going to do it because my head, this, see, it has a Velcro thing here and it sticks to my hair, but get the drip it's a sun hat sun visor and they only had one so i said you know what don't be too cute and think it's going to be here when you get back if you like it buy it get it i got it so oh let me just tell you this here now i opened up that green cosmetic bag and i found this inside so i haven't opened it but um yeah i'm gonna take it back it's a red one and i never liked uh, metal files anyway so it goes back and that's what i got from tar now I'm always in Walmart, so I picked up a few things. And the one thing I picked up because I want to fix those earrings that I just showed you, and some other earrings I purchased from um, a popular YouTuber, but a lot of the backs kept falling off, so I got that. And there was some other jewelry I wanted to fix that I be be wearing throughout the summer. Excuse me. I picked this up also because um, why not? It was only three dollars and some change. You can't see it, I'm sorry, but this says it's new by Evolve Essentials. This is the Frizz Free Hair Drying Tea. And somewhere over here, yeah, you can feel it. So if you're in the store, you can feel that. It's actually like a t shirt. And it was under $4. I think it was $3 and some change. That's really why I said I'll go ahead and get it. And um, they only had one color, which was gray. So I got that. Always, always pick up some brushes. So I got this one here from um, Elf. Because like I said, if a store has an Elf section, I'm in it. And this one is the contouring brush. Because Elf has, as you know, a lot of new stuff. A whole lot of new stuff. And then I also got this here, which is nothing new, but just to show it to you. Um, I hear a lot of people talk about how pretty it is. And this is the highlighting powder for Wet n Wild. This is called Precious Petals. So I said I'll pick this up. And sorry that... um. Hey, all right, you can see it. And then I love masks, so I picked up this mask here. This one here is by Freeman. All my masks are really by Freeman because I can't see paying twenty thousand dollars for a mask, but I love them. And this one here is a clay mask. It's a ten minute mask. It's supposed to instantly instantly detox and clear your pores for renewed skin. And this is the cucumber and pink salt. That's what this is. And the packaging looks like it should be sued. I bought two and I gave one away. So that's that. Let's see what else I have here because I have a whole bunch of stuff. But I'm trying not to show you a whole bunch of stuff. <laughs> but I am anyway. So now, like I mentioned to you, I'm always somewhere. So my mother kept telling me that um, we should try to go to a place called Roses. And I like that store. This is fast becoming my favorite store. We were supposed to go to New Bern today, and I was going to take myself into Roses because I didn't even get throughout the whole store. I mean, they have clothes, um, jewelry, food. It's like a Dollar General, Dollar Tree, National Liquidate. This is like that type of store, but I love this store. And this is something that I picked up. I picked up some rings, and I like these. I don't know if you can really see much of them because I didn't take them apart this time different designs and this was $3.98 I didn't think it was too bad and then I also picked up another one I believe one of these um, sets have um, 10 rings and another one may have like 12 and they both were $3.98 let's see what she 
$3.98 cent. Always, always, when I see cute studs, I will pick them up. Yes, I will. And I like these, especially the ones on the bottom, which you really can't see much. But I like them, and I thought they were cute. Yeah, and they had all different kind of um, other earrings, like the stars, the studs, the leaves. Really pretty, right? So I got that. Also, I picked up, because you can never have, now I have about five things to sleep in. And I always try to keep them clean, but I don't know what happened. Um, so I decided to get another one. This one I opened up is pink. And I think um, the roses, they had it for $3, which I thought the sign said two. And Walmart has the same. It's hard to open. Walmart has the same bonnet for $2. So I was going to take it back, but I just got it. If I ever need another one, I know to get it from Walmart. My mother said, I told you Walmart was cheaper. Yeah, okay. But I got this one in the same hour. I got this one in, which you know is the um, ethnic se section for the do-rags and stuff like that. <laughs> but look how big it is. It's really big. Look how big it is. And I got it because um, I just needed another one. Okay. So I got that from Roses also. From Roses, I picked up another one of these. Why? I don't know. But these things, this is a dollar. And you could never, ever go wrong with having enough of these. Plus, I don't know about you, but I like to change mine up every week. And if I have enough that's clean, great. If I don't, I'm just adding more on to it. And this is something else that I got from there because my mom gave me two drawers to keep some of my stuff in. And I just wanted to organize the drawer because um, I have stuff all over everywhere and I can't find anything. And it's just horrible. From Dollar General, I picked up these. Let's see. Yeah, because I don't know when, how, or when I'm going to do my nails. But I bought this before I cut my nails. Because if you, like I said, if you watch my channel quite often, you know I had really long nails. And this is what they look like now. Which is cool. Because now, for some reason, I feel like I can just wear all the funky, loud, crazy colors. So, you can wear them with loud, with long nails too. But I just don't. And at Dollar Tree, I can never find any of those great things that people find in Dollar Tree. I look. I look and I look, but I just can't find them. So I got these Yes to Carry um, facial wipes. I bought four packs. They were only a dollar because I got them from Dollar Tree. And I like them. I really, really like them. These things, they, they're, they're long enough and they are wet enough. You can wash your face and probably your whole body too. But I really like them. So I got those. Let's see what else did I get. Um, I think I pretty much showed you guys everything. Now, there's something else that I did get from... Um, roses because i needed it these are gowns remember how you if you live down south or well, you can live up north too but remember your grandma used to wear these gowns called go get my house coat so i got me one of these this one is short sleeve but i like the colors see the color and then i got this one here because i like it says um i love coffee yeah, and then it has all the different kind of things like hair on it like dark Sugar, decaf, those are the words that are going through it. Yeah. And yeah. And I just like him so much. These were $7.99. So that wasn't bad. And that's still roses. They have a lot of cute stuff. Um definitely something you can definitely use because um they got it. As a matter of fact, I think the next time I go, maybe I'll take you guys with me. So if you have a roses in your area or you know where one is, you may want to try to um, visit it because they have such great stuff. So I think I showed you guys everything that I got from my haul. Not everything I've bought since I've been here because I have been shopping. But I made this video very long. I don't want to make it much longer. So I am going to um, end this video now because I want to go to Dollar generally get some snacks for the evening and um what else um some water and then i have uh, my doggy down here looking at me yeah yeah i forgot where i left off at but either way i'm gonna end this video and i thank you guys for watching because i gotta get out of here my nephew just asked me to do something for him so i may do that why not and then let's see
yeah, I just want you guys to subscribe to my channel. That's a great thing. Subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. I'm all over the place now because um, talking to him got me a little discombobulated. And I just want to say thank you guys for watching, subscribing, and all that other good stuff. And share and spread love. I wanted to share with you what was on my nails in case anyone wanted to know. This is wet and wild. It looks kind of bluish, but it's really purplish. And it wasn't supposed to be uh, matchy-matchy with my shirt, but it just happened to be that way. Let's see if I can get it to show how it really Yeah, it doesn't really show up. But it's really purple, not pink. But if you know the color on a trip, then you'll know that's what I have on here. That's what the color is. Oh, okay. On the trip. And then I have on my lips, this here by, is this Black Radiance? This is Black Radiance. And this color here, oh my goodness, I can't even see what it is. It's 5401, but I'm sure it has a name. It's one of their matte lip creams, and I love matte lip creams. Oh my goodness, the color. That's what's on my lips. Yes, yeah.